How's it going guys, it's Jason here, and today's video is going to be on my Predator and Alien action figures from McFarlane Toys. So stick around and let's get to it. Alright, I thought I'd start it where the Alien and Predator series with McFarlane Toys all started, which was Movie Maniac Series 5, and that was released in 2002. So for Series 5, um, Alien and Predator were released in a box set. And this was before the AVP um, movie. So this is really cool. Uh, it comes with uh, Pre Predator and Alien. And a base with the Alien eggs. So that, that's really cool. I'll just show you the box. And here... In the back, we've got Alien and Predator, and the rest of the figures that were released in Movie Maniac Series 5. I've got the complete set of that, so if you stick around on my channel, I'll do a video review of them, as well as the 18-inch Movie Maniac's Edward Scissorhands. Uh, that's an awesome figure, and if you check out my channel now, I've, I've got a video of my 18-inch uh, McFarlane and NECA uh, figure collection, so... If you want to check that out, that's on my channel. So that's a really cool box set. Really happy when that came out with Series 5. And the other Predator figure that was released with Movie Maniac Series 5 is the Stealth Predator. And this figure was a Collector's Club exclusive by McFarlane Toys uh, that you could only get on the Spawn.com website. So that's a really hard to find figure now. It's the exact same mold as the Predator figure from this box set, except it's in the clear stealth mode that is in. So that's a really cool figure there. And I'll just show you the back of this box. So yeah, really happy with that figure as well, and super hard to find now. And that's uh, Movie Maniac Series 5. So next up here we have the Alien vs Predator line by McFarlane Toys, and this was released in 2004. It comes with five figures in this set, uh, with Celtic or Celtic Predator, who looks awesome, uh, Scar Predator, Elder Predator, without a mask, and the two aliens, Battle Alien, and Grid Alien. So I'll start with the Celtic Predator, comes with a um, spiral weapon just in the back there that he can hold in his hand, this looks really awesome. One thing that's an unusual with these uh, Predator figures from the series is that they all come with these massive long blades, uh, arm blades that are attached to their forearms. And in the movie, uh, none of the Predators actually had these long uh, arm blades. So it was very unusual. Uh, it must have been one of the concept uh, art pieces before the movie was uh, made. Um, so yeah, that's a bit unusual that they had them on there. Um, uh, the figures also come with uh, daggers that attach, uh, that have holsters in the um, shin. This is going to focus. But it's just in their shin, as well as um, Scar Predator comes with a large uh, shoulder cannon. It's just packaged back there. They all come with bases, which is really cool. You can see them, just see them in the background of... Uh, behind the figures and uh, Elder Predator there who has some awesome detail is the only one that comes without a mask one thing that I and he also comes with a cloak a red cloak behind the figure so that's really cool one thing I found really interesting was that uh, on the back of the package so all the the backs of uh, all these figures are the same it says um, in the bowels of Earth, uh, predators and aliens battle for supremacy. 
There's one sure loser in this epic war, Mankind. Based on the blockbuster Alien vs Predator movie, this line of action figures features incredible film-specific detail, many accessories and custom bases. Whoever wins, we lose. So there's the five figures there. One thing I found really interesting is that Scar Predator here is pictured without a mask. So it's got Elder Predator without a mask, Scar Predator without a mask, and uh, Celtic Predator with a mask. So, but one thing I found out online is that Scar Predator originally was going to come out with a variant, an unmasked variant, but this was never the case and was only released with a mask variant. So, um, and the masks are slightly different. So that's Scar Predator's mask. Yep, and there's Celtic Predator's mask, which doesn't want to focus. Yeah, there we go. I don't think that's going to work. But yeah, sorry about that. But yeah, the detail on these figures is awesome. They're massive figures. Uh, here we've got Battle Alien, who comes with a corpse, a rotted corpse on a slab or a bench. And uh, you can see there that the corpse has a face hugger attached to it, as well as a, um, a large hole in its chest where the alien would have busted out. So that's really cool. The alien's massive as well. Got a lot of detail. And here we have the grid alien, who has a massive base, massive circular base that it can stand on, as well as a painted head sculpt green paint on top that looks really awesome there as well so they're the five figures from the alien versus predator line here we have the McFarlane uh, collectors club exclusive stealth Celtic predator and this uh, also like the stealth predator who was a collectors club exclusive for movie maniac series 5 you could only get this figure from the Spawn.com McFarlane website. So this was also very exclusive. It's the same mold as the Celtic Predator and also comes with his uh, Shuriken uh, hand blade weapon, which is really cool. And that's also in a cloaked stealth mode, clear plastic. Uh, and what I really like about this stealth Celtic Predator is that it doesn't have the long blades... Uh, which are inaccurate to the movie anyway. So I'm really happy with this. It also comes with a base as well behind the figure. You can sort of see there. So that's really cool. Yep, same mold as the Celtic Predator. And I also just put it uh, next to the Stealth Predator just for comparison, which they look pretty awesome together as well. Just quickly show you the back of this figure. So the, uh, the back is a bit different to the standard AVP uh, figures. Whoever wins, we lose. This extremely limited edition action figure is a clear cloaked version of the stealth Celtic Predator figurine originally released in the McFarlane Toys Alien vs Predator line. Includes trophy, necklace, shuriken and base. Only available from the McFarlane Toys Collectors Club at spawn.com which is where I got it from back when it was released in 2004 so that's the uh, stealth Celtic predator from the McFarlane's AVP line and finally here we have the movie maniacs series 7 by McFarlane toys Colonel Marine Corporal Hicks uh, on the right is the standard figure from Movie Maniac 7, and on the left is the Collector's Club exclusive variant. Uh, they're quite similar. The standard variant uh, comes with a base in the background, an assault rifle just in that right corner, as well as the motion tracker that he has, strap, he has on a strap around his shoulder, just there. Uh, awesome figure. It's got great detail. Uh, the Collector's Club exclusive that could only be bought on the Spawn.com McFarlane website uh, has the motion tracker um, package separately in the blister. 
it's not around his shoulder. Uh, and also with the base comes with one of the alien eggs that's opened and he comes with a shotgun with the face hugger alien attached to it which looks really cool so that's the only differences are oh, and he also comes with his uh, helmet you can just see there Try and get a clear view there you go it comes with a helmet as well. I'll just show you the back. The back of both figures is the same. And it's got some of the figures from uh, Movie Maniacs Series 7, with including the um, Leatherface figures, or the Texas Chainsaw Massacre remake. Aaron, Old Monty, Sheriff Hoyt, and Leatherface, as well as Robocop, which is a cool figure. And they're from Series 7. It's just a write-up of the Series 7 movie Maniac figures that came out in 2004. So yeah, they're the two figures that I have from Movie Maniac Series 7 for the Alien, from the Alien series. Alright guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like. And also uh, comment on this video, let us know which one's your favourite Predator and uh, Alien action figure, either from the McFarlane or NECA series. And uh, yeah, keep an eye on my channel for more action figure videos and reviews. I'll speak to you soon. See ya.